Hello graders! Today I'll be teaching you how we can order numbers. I can definitely say that once you know how to compare numbers, then you can easily order them. Welcome to the class of Miss Anne where math is made easy. Today we are going to talk about ordering numbers. You can put numbers in order by placing them from lowest to highest, smallest to biggest, or least to greatest. This is called ascending order. Another term is increasing order. Example, 4, 6, 9, 18, 25. It's just like you're ascending to mountain. You can also put numbers in order by placing them from highest to lowest, biggest to smallest, or greatest to least. This is called descending order. Another term is decreasing order. Example, 43, 25, 20, 9, 7. It's just like you're going to descend from the sky. How do we order numbers? Are we going to call the waiter for us to order? No, that's not what I meant. When we say order, we have to arrange the numbers according to the given conditions. Compare two numbers at a time. Number one. Count the number of digits a number has. The more number of digits, the bigger the number. Number two, compare the number from left to right until the digits become different. Please note that plotting the numbers in the place value chart will make your life easy. Write the following numbers in order. Let's say, for example, we have 2,734, 358, 2,876 and 5,287. Count the number of digits in each number. 358 is the smallest number and it has only 3 digits. Line up the number accordingly to place value. Begin comparing from the left. So, 358 is the smallest number. We have to line up 2,734 and 2,876. In this case, the first digit in both numbers is 2. Then we have to proceed to the next digit. We have 7 and 8. Compare them. 7 is less than 8. That means to say the 2,734 is less than 2,876. In this group of numbers, 5,287 is the largest number. If we are going to arrange them in ascending order, that will be 358, 2,734, 2,876, and 5,287. When we do it in descending order, it is 5,287 first, 2,876, 2,734, and 358. That will be all for today. Thank you! Thank you for watching. Until our next lesson, see ya!